Ralph, 27-year-old Kristen Miranda Coffey of Summerfield Circle in Conover was arrested Thursday by Catawba County Sheriff's officers. She's charged with felony possession of Schedule 1 controlled substance, simple possession of Schedule 4 controlled substance, and possession of drug paraphernalia. Coffee was detained in the Catawba County Detention Facility following the arrest under $5,000 bond. A district court date was scheduled for today. 35-year-old Matthew James Montgomery of Red Apple Drive in Bessemer City was arrested Thursday by Newton police officers. He's charged on a bill of indictment with attempt to obtain controlled substance by forgery or fraud. Montgomery was incarcerated in the Catawba County Detention Facility under $2,500 bond. A superior court appearance was scheduled for today. 30-year-old Christopher Miguel Sanchez of 17th Street Northeast in Hickory was arrested last Tuesday by Hickory police and charged with felony probation violation. Sanchez is on probation as he serves a 30-month suspended sentence following a Catawba County conviction in January of this year for felony possession of Schedule II controlled substance and misdemeanor possession of Schedule IV controlled substance. Sanchez was taken into custody last Tuesday without incident at the Hickory Police Department. He was placed in the Catawba County Detention Facility with bonds set at $10,000 secured. He remained in jail as of earlier today. The next court appearance for Sanchez is July 19th. 24-year-old Christian Dior Sifford of 12th Avenue Southeast in Hickory was arrested by Hickory police last Tuesday on one felony count of possession of cocaine and one misdemeanor count of possession of marijuana up to half an ounce. He was arrested after Hickory police responded to reports of illegal narcotics activity on the 100 block of 10th Avenue Southeast. While on the scene, officers saw Christian Sifford with a marijuana cigarette behind his ear, Sifford was stopped and during a search, 0.7 grams of marijuana and 1.1 grams of crack cocaine were found. Sifford was released on $1,500 bond. His next district court date is scheduled for July 19th. Reporting from Catawba County for WHKY-TV News, I'm Rob Eastwood. Back to you, Ralph.